Um, yeah, I'm the founder of, of Repella, which is uh, the anti-shark deterrent for surfers. And uh, this has been designed to help shark attacks, or reduce shark attacks on surfers around the globe. So this is our update of the new product. And this is the version two. And we've just made some small changes and we, we've done seven years of research. Uh, we specifically focus on white sharks, uh, but we are also doing uh, tiger sharks and more bull sharks. We did some bull sharks and some white sharks in Australia six years ago, and we still had some good effects. But the, our main focus has been uh, for white sharks and deterring white sharks from attacks on surfers. Uh, we, we've done our research in uh, Mexico, South Africa, New Zealand, Australia, and the US. So we have a uh, independent scientific report which was published in September, and you can read that on our website at repeller.com. Uh, and this, is, this has been updated with our latest product. Uh, we started this product in uh, about uh, September this year. So there's already quite a few in the system here. And I uh, really thank everybody for their support with the Repella product uh, in Reunion. Uh, en bref, ça c'est Dave. Dave est un des fondateurs de Repella. Uh, ça fait sept ans qu'ils ont fait le re uh, de recherche et tout ça. Uh, ils, ont prom ils ont focalisé plus sur les requins grands blancs. Uh, ils ont fait un peu de re recherche sur des bulldogs, mais plus et des tigres, mais plus sur uh, les grands blancs. Um, voilà. Okay. Yeah. The, the only research that was done was the surfboard, was the one that you see on the video. And this was done in uh, Guadalupe, which is uh, off Mexico. Yeah. Donc, il va nous montrer une vidéo. Ça, ça montre la recherche qu'ils ont fait à Guadalupe avec une planche de surf. So we, we actually get a... Um, normally we use a decoy surfboard, so it's not a surfboard. But in the latest uh, research in Mexico, we used uh, a real surfboard for the first time in seven years, and we actually put uh, tuna, fresh tuna, off the board. And the tuna was uh, the same length as what your leg is, and this was to replicate the surfers in the water. Uh, this was, we never lost one bait in Mexico, and this will be updated in our latest report. Uh, the report says that it's 66% more effective, but this report and testing was always done with tuna on the surfboard. So it's not a normal situation, but it reduces the risk of attack by at least two thirds. So the tests that they have done, they have used big pieces of time to replicate the arms of the surfer. And with all the tests that they have done, with all the pieces of time, they have never lost a piece. So all the pieces are still there, the rocks are not taken the pieces. And with these results, va être uh, mis sur ligne sur uh, on your website yeah. sur leur site uh, internet. Okay, so I just want to explain the difference between the the old repeller and the new repeller. So the old repeller. Donc, maintenant, il va expliquer les différences entre le vieux repeller et le nouvel repeller. Okay. So this is the new unit, which is this one here. This is, it looks almost the same, but it has a bigger electrode on the front. It's the same weight. Ça c'est le nouveau uh, pièce. Ça ressemble le même mais le electrode c'est plus large. And it still uh, fits into the same housing that's currently in the in the system. Uh, we will make sure it always fits into the same housing. Donc on peut mettre ça dans le même uh, what? What here? What here? Uh, the difference with the unit is that it, uh, we dropped the frequency and uh, we tried to increase the field, the strength of the field. Okay. Uh, the difference with this piece is that they have changed the frequency of the electrodes. And uh, you dropped the frequency. Yeah, yeah, we, changed the, we changed the frequency from 15 pulses every second to 9.5 pulses every second. Okay. 
So it's a little slower. All that does is allows the device to recharge before each pulse. So that is 15 pulse. It was 15 pulses every second, um, and now it's 9.5 pulses every second. Uh, pulses every second. Okay, so they have the frequency. Comme ça, euh, ça donne plus de vie à, 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 le, à la pièce. Quoi. OK. Uh, besides the, the electrode here, which is bigger on the front, uh, we also put a bigger front electrode, which is here. Now, this one's interchangeable. Anybody that has the current system can easily update this. And um, we have this available here. So simple to get it installed. All the new housings come with this. Yeah, sorry. Yeah. Donc, aussi que une uh, électrode plus large là, celui est plus large aussi. Et ça peut être changé avec les, les vieux modèles aussi. On peut changer yeah. facilement. This just creates a stronger field, not a bigger field, just a stronger field. Ça, ça donne une plus grande force autour de so for, the, the, for those that don't know about the repeller system, it uh, simply clips into your board in the back here. And between this device and the front electrode, it creates an electromagnetic field around the surfboard. So for those who don't know, the device works simply. You put this there. Et avec les deux électrodes, ça donne une le mot champ magnétique. Une champ magnétique autour de la planche. Yeah, and also recharges uh, in three hours. The device, sorry, the device lasts for six hours and it recharges in three hours. Okay, donc la duration de batterie c'est six heures, mais tu peux le recharger le batterie en trois heures. Okay, if uh, when you handle your board, uh, the board, you just need to re-change the way you surf a little bit, like just from handling your board, not the way you surf, but the way you handle your board. Uh, basically, pick the board up from the center of the board and you won't feel any any residual current. Donc, uh, ça fait aucune différence de ton manière de surf, juste uh, un petit peu de, con pas conscience, mais... Uh, uh, Quand tu portes la planche, fais, fais gaffe, quoi. Parce que... Yeah. Uh, when, when you paddle out, when you're surfing, uh, you need to check that is is working. You simply just put your hand past this while you're paddling, and this, uh, you can tell it's running. It's just a mild tingle in your hand, so you know it's working. You need to do this while you're surfing to make sure it's operating. OK. Uh, pour, pour être sûr que ça marche quand tu rentres en l'eau, uh, quand tu paddle out, tu fais simplement mettre ta main en dessous de la planche et tu sembles si uh, tu sembles champ magnétique. I just want to make sure that everybody that has a system as well now, this one and the, the latest one, it's really important that it gets clean. And all you have to do is take it out of the board and just dip it in a bucket of water, or just wash it with your with your water and both sides. Just give it a quick rinse, dry it off, and it will keep going for you. You don't have to, um, you don't have to redo it, like get it changed. Donc, Please. Uh, comme tous les matières matière de surf, uh, après l'usage, on doit rincer avec de l'eau douce. Uh, also, like every six months, within six months, you need to just go and get it checked, and you possibly need to get a, a service, a six-month service. Okay. Where, where can they do that? They can do that at. Currently, they will do the service at Mickey Rat's shop. It's 25 euros. Donc, uh, c'est conseillé de tous les six mois de faire une uh, révision. Tu vas chez Mickey Rat. Uh, pour l'instant, chez Mickey Rat, il fait le service. So, the, um, a lot of people have uh, asked if they can order bulk on our website uh, to save shipping. Uh, because of the aviation, like for the aviation laws, we can only ship two units uh, on any any order. Il avait beaucoup beaucoup de monde a demandé lui des questions concernant des des commandes en grande quantité, et lui a 
avec tous les bureaucrats et tout ça, il peut seulement faire deux pièces de chaque commande. So if you if you order online, uh, you know the most we can ship is two units, so it's, it ends up being 20 euros each for shipping. Which is, uh, I'm reducing, I'm subsidising all the shipping by 50 percent. So uh, yeah, the shipping to here is really expensive, and that's that's about the best I can do. Le maximum que tu peux commander sur le site c'est deux pièces, uh, et ça coûte uh, 20 dollars australiennes uh, par pièce uh, pour le shipping. Hey, it's the best thing to do with all the restrictions. Um, do we have any questions? Est-ce qu'il y a des questions? <laughs> How far? Uh, the field? The field, yes. The field and, is and, uh, three meters in diameter. With the new system? With the new system as well. And the yeah. old system? The same. Yeah, it's just, it's stronger. Yeah. So it's... Uh, you, you can you can measure it out further, but we find that the effective stopping range for the shark is is like one one point five meters. Yep. Uh, if I want to put several boats, yep. What do I need to buy? Just one battery. Yeah, one battery and the housing. The housings are on our site. The housing and sub. Uh, they're I think they're about thirty euros, uh, thirty five euros for that, and um, we just ship as many of those as you want. There's no restrictions on the housings. How long is it uh, expected to work without uh, any problems? You should get about, um, if, it, if it's clean and maintained, you should get at least two years out of it. Yeah. Uh, do, do you plan to have any reseller? Yeah, we are. Currently we're selling online, but we are going to do some retail sales this year. Uh, probably by the middle of the year we should be able to retail through, through Hurley and these guys. Uh, yeah, so we will be doing that. We're just trying to organise a better shipping into into reunion. For a young surfer, which is six years old, is there any uh, health problem? Uh, we we have had the health checks done on this. Um, the the biggest issue we have with um, small boards is there's not enough field. If you reduce the field from this, and you can't fit it into small boards under five feet. Even boards under five, six, it's not not effective enough. No, it's Sorry? No, but he falls the taille of the planche. With the size of his board, yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah, the health risk, yeah. Yeah, yeah. So, yeah, we had the health checks done on that um, to get the C certification, and there was no health health uh, problems with that. They just said they advise people with uh, pacemakers and with like any pregnant women shouldn't use it or with a pacemaker. Yeah. Uh, no we haven't we haven't had uh, any any I mean we have to we have to do a study on that one. But the the C E lead this one with the health. Yeah. We just don't advise children using it because it's uh, us in a small board it's not protective. How many bull sharks have you tested? Uh, we tested with, uh, we did two, three studies with the bull sharks um, off the north of Australia. Trois études au nord d'Australie. How many specimens? Uh, of bull sharks? Uh, how many individuals? I guess that's How many individuals? Uh, more than 50. Plus de 50.